Hi, my name is Dave Garcia. I'm a concerned citizen, um, especially about uh, fracking going on in California. Uh, I originally got involved uh, through the Sierra Club. Uh, right now, we're currently uh, up in the Sutter Buttes in Sutter County, and we're looking at a uh, frack well that was probably put in in 2011. The, the problem with, with these, these wells is uh, basically the Sutter Buttes are sitting on this huge aquifer, and uh, if there is any contamination, it's, it's going to get into uh, the aquifer. Uh, as general you know, public, we really need to be concerned about our, our groundwater. My name is Bishop Ron Allen, Bishop Dr. Ron Allen. I am the CEO and President of the International Faith-Based Coalition and the Chairman of CEU. And we got involved with this project, uh, taking a look at the underserved community and truly understanding that uh, if we don't do something about energy and gas, that we're going to lose jobs. Uh, we decided that we're going to get in this fight uh, for uh, oil, energy, and uh, we're going to try our best to save jobs and to create jobs um, in the underserved community and to make this thing happen for, uh, I should say, the, you know, the state of California and the United States. Uh, fracking uh, has to happen. So we are for the fracking. We are for the drilling. These wells electronically uh, monitored, and, and, and you know, and you got uh, computers, and so there's nobody needed here at the site anymore, other than to come by maybe once a week to to check on on, on some of the stuff. But I mean, with you know, with uh, computers and all that, they can probably do it back at the main office. And they're not long-term jobs. That's that's the problem. They're they're just initial jobs to get the wells in. And then that's it. Would you please sign our signature to ban fracking in yes, Butte County? Thank you. I would really I want appreciate to. it. I want to. We are going to bring this to the Board of Supervisors. I need to. So that we will keep watch on fracking in Butte County and hopefully prevent it. 